Poland qualified for their first UEFA European Championship tournament in 2008. Four years later, they were co-hosts, but finished bottom of their group on both occasions. This June, Poland kick off their Euro 2016 campaign against Northern Ireland, looking to finally make their mark at the tournament. It's a big event, and I think everyone in Poland has hopes for our team. Because in the qualifiers, we showed that we are capable of achieving very good results against strong sides. And since the end of qualification, during our friendly matches, we keep on showing that we are a team who can put up a good fight. I hope this tournament will be exciting for us and that we can make our fans happy. Poland's greatest team played in four consecutive World Cups, finishing third in 1974 and 1982. Their stars were Gregor Lato and Zbigniew Boniek, who scored 16 World Cup goals between them. Now they have Robert Lewandowski. His 13 goals in the qualifiers is a joint record, and he's key if his team are to fulfill Polish hopes and to make it out of the group stage this summer. I think it's difficult to predict the success that we might have. I believe that we should treat this tournament like all our other games. If we focus on that, it will give us a chance to win the group. And then hopefully, in the latter stages, who knows? I hope that our team will be the surprise of the tournament or the dark horses, and we have some big results. It's hard for me to say exactly what we'll do, but I hope that it will be something special, and our fans will remember it for the rest of their lives. It's been 10 years since Poland's last appearance at a World Cup. A strong showing in France will build confidence for the White and Reds, going into qualifying for Russia 2018. At the minute, we're very much concentrated on the Euros. We're not thinking about what will happen after that. The Euros is the culmination of what we started two years ago, when the qualifiers began. The team has been training together since then, so we will see how the Euros go. And then, I imagine there might be a few changes introduced before 2018. However, until then, the team is very much focused on 2016. And we'll see what will happen after that.